Whatever line of work you're in, imagine being one of a handful up for one of your industry's highest honors. Well, that dream is now a reality for the owner of Elemi, a popular restaurant downtown. Tonight, extra perspective from the chef who put it all on the line and is now an elite company shining a proud light, a proud light on the Sun City. The flames are flickering, the water boiling, and the vegetables prepped. David, you already do the tortillas? Tortillas? It's another busy day in the kitchen at Alemi. This is Emiliano Marentes, chef and owner of Alemi. The name coming from his wife and his childhood nickname, Emmy. In Mexico, that's how they, uh, you know, name some restaurants. You know, if it's El Juan or El Charlie. So she thought about the name like that in one single word. I always knew that he would be very successful. So I've always, always encouraged him to go for it. Go for it he did, opening his own restaurant for the first time in 2019 on Kansas Street in downtown El Paso. And that chance on himself now paying off. Marentes was just named a semifinalist for a James Beard Award in the category of Outstanding Chef. Teared up, honestly. It's something that, as a chef, that's something you dream about, but you never think about. Um, especially someone in El Paso that, you know, we're not in Austin, we're not in L.A., Chicago, so we don't think that we're ever going to get that award, especially a small independent restaurant. I just think it's amazing. I mean, I, when he called me, I was, you know, I cried. <laughs> One of our cooks even cried because they, we just... We all know how hard he works. He, I always say this, even when I hashtag anything he does, I, I say hardest working man in the business, and I genuinely mean it. Marentes already featured on Hulu's Taste the Nation. Now this triumph made even more remarkable by the fact that this relatively new restaurant is thriving despite the pandemic challenges. I could have been not in a good mood the morning before, trying to get to work, trying to figure out our staffing situation. And then this hits you and you're just like, that's why we do this. And for the customers, thank you guys for supporting and stopping by, who come from near and far. I'm actually coming from New York, and my wife, you know, when comes here, like, we always come here. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Yeah, I know. It's great. Awesome. Yeah, I love it. Marentes is one of 19 semifinalists for Outstanding Chef. The winner will be announced March 16th and then honored at the James Beard Restaurant Ceremony on June 13th in Chicago. But even just being named a semifinalist, puts him in some rare, rare company. My wife and I love to watch a lot of Food Network and cooking, uh, uh, cooking show uh, shows. So we are very familiar with the James Beard Award. We know how big of a deal that is. And uh, it's really neat to have someone here in El Paso as a semifinalist. And I definitely need to make my way down there.